do you have a cabinet full of drinks nobody wants? <laughs> Mom, I've never met a single person who's gone round someone's house and drank a creme de monde. Why have you got some blue caracol? Whatever on earth that may be. And an open bottle of sherry that has been there since April 1973. What made you decide to stockpile at the car for booth and ginger wine? Mom, I think we might go without you preserving them in time. I know you're keeping them for emergencies. And I get that mindset, I do. But there will never be an emergency. That needs 1990s port that's been provided by you. But it was nearly 30 years ago. So in the words of frozen time, to bin that limoncello, yes, Mum, let it go. At Easter and at Christmas, you stare at us in disbelief. As one by one, we all say, Ooh, no thanks, to your dangerously out of date aperitifs. I don't do what decaying babies with the crust around the lid and nobody alive today knows what Angostura and bitters actually is and the thing about the situation is that mum you don't even drink so take this dusty booze museum and flush it down the sea I know you think it's wasteful cause they'll never go for me Tables. I bet I get them in your will. Yes, you'll keep them till the day you die in that cabinet I presume. So the only spirits haunting me. Yes, the only spirits. Do you get it? Spirits? No. Haunting me are the ones. 